What a night. <laughs> That's the last time I'm mixing beer and Bailey's Irish cream. Let me tell you. Back. Leon, it's been six hours since our last transmission. I was starting to get worried. Don't you mean lonely? <laughs> anyway, I started to smooth, feel Leon. dizzy, and then I guess I must have lost consciousness. Well, just lost whip your consciousness? Dick out and show it to her. <laughs> Maybe that has some connection to what the village chief was talking about. Hmm. Can't say. But I'm all right now. I'm going to continue my mission. All right. You pumped? Ah, you pumped? Let's do it. Major Slack here. I'm on the wheel, and y'all can ride shotgun. Let's play some more Resident Evil 4. We just killed the lake monster. And... Looking around for our prize. Anonymous letter. This is important. Read it up, boys and girls. It's an important item hidden in the falls. If you are able to get it, you might be able to get Ashley out of the church. But I'll warn you, the route to the church isn't a walk in the park by any means. They've deployed what's called an El Gigante. So God bless. That sounds like something big. <laughs> About what's been going on in your body, if I could help you, I would. But unfortunately, it's beyond my power. You might want to check out the local AA. <laughs> Alright, so that's that. Don't forget this flash grenade over here. And that's that. Alright, so... Leon's got a drinking and drug problem. Let's go to the local AA. And the local AA is right across the lake there. Those two blue lights right there, right? <laughs> Sign up. Got a bit of a stomach ache, but we'll take care of that later. No, actually, um, across the lake is uh, a merchant's shop that opens up only uh, after you kill the lake monster, okay? So if you're looking for a a prize for killing the lake monster. That's essentially it. Um, there's a whole bunch of goodies there to collect and whatnot. <laughs> nice driving slack. Now, before you go out, make sure you bust all the barrels. And you could collect anywhere from uh, 4,500 to 6,000 pesetas, so you make sure you get them all. And the merchant isn't here, but don't go in there yet. Some more stuff to do. Push this box out of the way. We're going to raid him. Take all his goodies. Climb upstairs, push some more boxes out of the way. Let's go here, let's stop this barrel. Doing pretty good. Should get a, uh, a jewel to put in the elegant mask here. The green gem. The markings on this piece indicate that it was once set in something, so let's try mixing it with the elegant mask, and it works. And by the way, uh, the green cat's eye that we collected earlier, that goes with the beer, the beer mug, <laughs> or rather the beer stein. And that's that. But don't go back the way you came. There's actually a hole going right down there into the merchant shop. If you go down there, um, you get right behind the desk of the merchant, and there's ten rifle bullets there, which is really valuable. There you go, ten rifle bullets. So make sure you get that. And I'm, I'm ripped to the tits here. Um, okay, gonna have to make some room. That guy there. There we go. <laughs> Squeak that in there, and let's do some business. Got some rare things on sale, stranger. <laughs> what a coincidence. So do I. What are you selling? Well, um... Can I interest you in a beautiful gold bangle? This will look lovely on your head. You know, go to a party, look real nice. Nice looking guy like you, huh? How about it? 10,000 pesetas. Ah, 
I'll buy it at a high price. <laughs> there you go, pretty boy. <laughs> Thank you. And uh, how about an antique pipe so you can smoke uh, some of that herb? I'll buy it at a high price. There you go. <laughs> Thank you. And I think that's about all for now. Oh, I think I got some TMP ammo that might interest you. I take this off my Is hands. <laughs> Thank you. Now, how about what some tune ups? Buying? I think I would like to tune up my shotgun, Is give it more old? power. <laughs> Thank you. Since we're going to be using it uh, soon to take on a uh, gigantic monster, let's tune up the um, old stranger? <laughs> firepower on Thank the rifle, you. too. And you know what? I think that's about all for now. Ta ta. See you in the funny papers. Okay, so we just go back the way we came. Now, um, why am I not healing myself? Because we're going to go fishing. Right off the dock that we just left. There's a whole bunch of fish. There's at least two large bass. Those will refill your health completely. And a whole bunch of small bass. And you can't get them. Just because they're in the water, it doesn't mean you can't get them. You can get them. And I'll show you how. Uh, if you don't want to waste ammo, you can just use your harpoon. This takes a while, though. You gotta be a good shot, too. Beer fishing. Got one. Yeah. Okay, let's go let's go see what it is. So they, here's how you get it. You just park the boat right on top of the, you know, the pickup. And you'll get the, the take prompt. There you go. And it's a large bass. And it's prompting me to use it. And I'm gonna use it, refill my health completely, and that's that. So you can spend some time fishing here. If you got, you know, Del Lago, the lake monster give you a big spanking and you know you're really low on health and really low on, you know, um, herbs and whatnot, you can spend some time. Um, fishing off the dock and to refill your health and fill up your inventory with a bunch of health item health items but I'm full so don't need it because I'm such a damn good gamer <laughs> and let us not forget modest all right off into the wild blue yonder we go gonna face a new monster it's kind of like this, um, well, they call, it's officially known as La Plagas or something like that. Anyways, it's just like a zombie, except um, I know somebody out there is going to post a comment saying, those aren't zombies slacking. Yeah, I know they're not zombies. I'm just calling them zombies. This guy here has a bit of a spaz, and then he goes forth with this squid-like thing, and um, he's dangerous. He can like really do a lot of damage. I'll just show you just for demonstration purposes. <laughs> if he can hit you. <laughs> yeah, a lot of damage. So um keep your distance. And once they sprout that tentacle head there like that, they're really vulnerable to flash grenades. In fact, They'll die instantly if you throw a flash grenade. So that's the easiest solution to take care of these guys. Burst forth with hellacious snake -like, snake head like thing. Run away. Run away! Load up your flash grenade. Pop one off. Hey, the snake head guy dies instantly. Let's go kick the shit out of this guy. Here we go again. No, oh, no, Slack, please. No, have some Christmas spirit. Alright. Slash it through your throat with a bloody bowie knife. Oh, what fun it is to kick your ass on through the night. Oh, kicking your ass, kicking your ass, kicking it all the way. Oh, what fun it is to kick your ass on through the day. Hey, kicking your ass. <laughs> yeah. All together now. <laughs> okay, I'll stop now. <laughs> Onward into the waterfall area. A kind of sort of a puzzle to solve here. It's not really that hard. 